Sample Amplitude Pro X3, new in build 296, exporting mono and stereo stems in a single pass. I did a previous video called Exporting Individual Tracks as Stems Multitrack Bounce. The main drawback was you needed to do it in two passes, one pass for mono stems and another pass for stereo stems. But in the latest update, build 296, it's now possible to bounce mono and stereo stems in one pass. So this is a great improvement and a big time saver. It's a fairly straightforward process. The main thing is that you have the mono buttons enabled for mono tracks, but these will be turned on already if you've been recording mono inputs. So they will take care of themselves, as will the stereo tracks. The drum kit is from Independence and I've manually assigned the kick, snare and hats as mono. The toms are stereo, as are the cymbals, and the tambourine is mono. So we have a mix of stereo and mono tracks. The upshot of this is that Samplitude will now be able to bounce mono and stereo tracks in one hit. So I'm opening the track bounce dialog. Under the horizontal heading I'm choosing from VIP start to last object. Under the heading vertical special functions I'm selecting all audible tracks individually multi-track bounce. Under generate I'm choosing new VIP. This will let us check the audio has been bounced correctly. Left click where it says stereo and at the bottom of the list there's a new entry called automatically. This new setting will differentiate between mono and stereo tracks when creating stems. I'm clicking OK and saving it to a folder I've created. A new project is created and the stems will now be placed into this new project. I'm going to speed this part of the video up. So that's the bouncing completed and now we have mono and stereo stems created in a single pass, a considerable time saver. I'm sure you'll all agree it's a big improvement. Anyway, until next time, all the best.